So basically, our research found a link between fasting and hair growth. So our lab worked on the uh, somatic stem cells uh, in the skin. So we study the regeneration of the skin uh, and also the hair follicles uh, which make the hairs. What we found is that uh, during the intermittent fasting, the hair growth will be affected. So uh, we, in the animal models, we found that uh, intermittent fasting will decrease uh, the regeneration of the hair follicles. But uh, in the human, we found that uh, intermittent fasting will cause uh, a slower hair growth. There are very popular intermittent fasting uh, paradigms recently called time restricted eating. Basically, you do you, uh, the most common ones is like uh, 16 to 8. Basically, you do 16 hours of fasting and then eat all your meals within like 8 hours. And there's also people do like alternate day fasting. Basically, you eat one day and then you fast for the other day. So that's basically the uh, fasting paradigm that we use in our experiment. So what we found that uh, in uh, both, in either of these uh, fasting methods, we are caused uh, a defect uh, in the hair follicle regeneration uh, in our animal models. So we did a small trial uh, in, in humans, uh, so which have like a 10 people each group. So we, what we did is like 18 hours of fasting each day, and then uh, the people, the participants eat within six hours. So that actually caused uh, about 18% of decrease uh, in their average hair growth. So uh, I, I probably, we probably should eat uh, longer time than that. Uh, so I think the regular three meals per day will be just be okay. So we did a me mechanistic characterization of why intermittent fasting caused this defect. So what we found is that um, it's not, the animal didn't really eat less, right? Or it's because of the change of the circadian rhythms. Actually, it is because it's, it's more related to the uh, the length between the meals, right? So the longer the length between meals, the more severe the defect becomes. So what we found is that uh, when the, the interval between meals become too long, and then your body activate a systemic response to utilize uh, another energy uh, resources called the fat. And then that's caused the problem because these stem cells, uh, these just activated stem cells cannot use, use fat. So, and then they go through uh, a process called programmed cell death and that's uh, with basically self-destruction and then cause the uh, regeneration defect. We also see some defect associated with the calorie restrictions. So uh, I think generally the hair growth is very sensitive to your nutrients levels of the body. So uh, if you want to grow hairs, probably you have to eat well uh, <laughs> or eat regularly uh, rather than do fasting. Uh.